So this is my uh, joy uh, warm up. It, we use the word joy from German, which is Freude, and it comes from uh, Ode to Joy, which is the fourth movement of Beethoven 9. It is the tune that everybody knows, whether they can name it or not. It's the tune that everybody knows. And it, but instead of singing all the German, we're just going to replace all of the German with the word Freude, which means joy. So all of the joy is in your body, it's in your eyes, it's in your communication with everybody else in your choir. And it sounds like this. Freude, 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 Freude. And that's the funny bit, because <laughs> you've got another... Uh, syllable in so you have to sing Freud de, de, which makes no sense in English or German but even the Germans find it funny Freud 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 so you can play with all the chatting around what kind of vowel sound you're going to make how you animate your face where you're going to put the joy in your face and how you're going to kind of elevate that room just to kind of sing in a really beautiful funny way and um, there is another part which sits underneath Freude, 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 Freude Freude, Freude, Freude da. So clearly that's for basses and altos and once you've sung it in classic uh, choir terms you can go up there and you know when it's higher it's just going to be more joyful isn't it it's going to make you smile more Freude, 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 Freude. as much as your choir can go and you've only got one word to learn and it's Freude and it means joy <laughs>